last week we went up with a cable car and visited his beautiful gardens. We also took a the bogan ride down the hill without brakes and without wheels and it was very sharp corners. <laughs> this week we rented a car and went and visited the highest cliff in Europe. We also visited some volcanic pools or lava pools and then we went for a look for the notorious A-frame houses. This is Captain Frick and his first mate Pietru. We decided to chuck everything, leave the rat race and just embark on a new adventure. And that is our new home, Sisu. Join us on our epic journey as we sail the oceans, discovering new horizons, new cultures, new tastes, new flavors, new everything. It's just such a vast, vast world to explore out there. So please join us in our quest. The clutch doesn't work well, the brakes doesn't work well. The, if you change gears, you can hear it trying to crunch a few gears. It's but not, it's, a, it's a 4x4 because <laughs> it's a rental. It's not a 4x4, <laughs> it's a small little car. I think it's used as a 4x4, that's why it's doing what it's doing. So we're in Cabo Girao. Girao. G I R A. Anyway, parking is not the easiest thing yet. Even if you have a very small car. <laughs> Even if the car is a little bit broken, it doesn't work. And no, no space. But the parking lot is there's a pretty high turnover. So if you just wait a little bit. Yeah, patience. Patience. You shall find a parking. Yeah. Even if it's two wheels on the pavement. <laughs> Yeah. Which we did. Yeah, the rentals are the best 4x4s. I think we have to buy a ticket here. What is this for? Um, okay, just go in and tickets. out. I think for now. Uh, okay. Let's go in and out. Looks like we can just walk through. We just walk through. And everybody's standing on the glass. Oh. Fear of heights, I do have that. Even though I'm a pilot and a paraglider and jump off mountains and things like that. But it's just different if you have a reference. That this is high and that was high.
Sai, 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 pra lei, sai. Pra lei, nem pode ser pra quê? Não, não, nada pra lei, não. Vamos fazer uma zé. Vamos ter uma zé na lei. Em South Africa, we have this thing. The kerk in the bar is langs mekaar. And I always thought that's a funny thing to do. The church and the bar is next to each other. But here, it's literally like that. Look, church. And then rows and rows of bars. These tunnels, they are just amazing. They go from, from 10 meters or 300 meters to 3 kilometers. It, and this one that we in now is like 2 kilometers. And it, they go up and down and go around. They, they make circles in this, in the mountain. It is, how do they to figure that out? Second step is beer. Um, we will take a medium, we'll take a small small beer, medium, a pint. Yeah. <laughs> Step number three, we're going to fry it ourselves. <laughs> This is my first ish potato I'll be going to buy. I need now to turn this thing all the time. A little bit at a time. Like, almost like a rotisserie. And step, the last step is having a nice beer. And apparently you need to eat it with your hand, which we in South Africa is quite good. No mm. problem with that. Mm. And they serve this delicious bread. Mm. Mm. Fatty, fatty, fatty. <laughs> the final, final, final step is to pay. And that was a surprise. The biggest pleasure so far. <laughs> yeah. 8 euro 90. Yeah, 8 92. Euros, eight euro point ninety two, not eight hundred. It's eight euros. <laughs> it's eight just like point, yeah, eight point. It's the cheapest meal we've ever had since leaving Cape Town. It was two beers, huh? Yeah. Since leaving Cape, Cape Town. Town yeah. But this is just the cutest, cutest, cutest place. Look at this. Porta. 
Porto de Abrigo Wine Lodge. Yo, yo, I this cute little place next to the road. Ooh. And then we're gonna go in there. So let's go see. It didn't work. It looks it cute, is. but <laughs> maybe a long time ago it was something. We found this village. This is, this is it. <laughs> this is the village. Just look. And it's so cute. But this is the whole village. And it's, it consists of like one, two, three, four, four restaurants. This is a target rich environment. It's a grotto. I think it's going to be a esh patata. The chicken one looks divine. Frickle lamb and beef. Check it out inside. Big ex ex expectations on esh patatas. <laughs> Yummy. We went into the forest of Madeira and we found this waterfall. Look at that! Awesome waterfall! And we didn't need to walk far. It was just from that restaurant. From that one. <laughs> so, but it's so beautiful. The scenery is just beautiful. Just look at that. And look at this. On this side of the bridge, look, the river is going on, but there's also a little canal system going, going through and then all the way there with all sorts of sluices and a very in, intricate, intric, well, a little complicated system. We did 500 meters of the 11 kilometer Portela hike, so we need a beer now. It's been a lot of exercise 
We looked, we actually came to Santana to see the old style houses. And we thought it's a town full of these houses. We only found this three and then it's maybe oh, four. And it's maybe one or two in town. So all the other houses is modern. Here is the old style houses. They actually have a theme park for that. There's one, two, three, four. I thought it was going to be like hillside, you know, like Heidi in the mountains and lots of little houses and little goats running around. It's a lot of curio shops. And they just full of curio shops. <laughs> yeah. Dead, dead Over here it's very calm. Calm, not calm. Shall I dive? It was still a long way back home and we got into the car and drove for Funchal. It was a relief to be back in Funchal and to drop the car off at the rental company. So we found ourselves here in a little pub called number two in Madeira. Number pub number two in number, no, Madeira. And I saw I've got a very big collection of rum, which is like, mm, we are sailors, let's drink rum. And, and this is the cheapest one called, I don't know, five years old, but it's from Barbados. And here's another plantation one from Trinidad. So it's like different ones, but called the same. And here's one that's pineapple. So pineapple, pineapple rum. And here's one that I don't want to try. It's 69. It's got a it's, red label. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, I, I honestly think that one is worse than sisu rum. But it's also plantation. So we got this one. It's a five years old from Barbados. 
And if we ever go to the Caribbean, one of the destinations we think, uh, when, it will be in a year or two, when we get there, we are planning, actually landing on Barbados. So it might be that we actually will find our favorite rum besides Sisu rum on Barbados. Plantation. Uh, who ever thought that plantation was a rum? Yeah. Half orange juice and a half vodka. I like the vodka. <laughs> Next week we set sail for Tunisia and it was most probably our toughest sail ever. It was 2,500 miles in pretty rough conditions. We, we had breaking waves and winds up to 40 knots. We also almost been boarded by refugees. And then after the second storm, we found a capsized boat. We arrived in a beautiful town of Hamamik. <laughs> 